for manual muscle testing of hip external and internal rotation, the person is going to be placed on, they will be sitting. I will have her bring her sole of her foot towards her other leg for external rotation and her knee and her knee off of the mat some. I will place one hand just proximal to the knee joint. I'm going to place my other hand at just proximal to her ankle and I am going to push down with one hand and pull out with my bottom hand. Okay? And I'm gonna so I'm gonna ask her to hold that position and do not let me don't let me turn your leg out. Okay? I'll push out like that. Okay? Can you hold it? Yes. Hold it, don't let me push down. Okay, good. Now for hip internal rotation, I'm going to have her do the same thing. I'm going to have her bring her leg out and her knee up. Hold on just a second. Wow. I didn't know it could do that. That's really neat. I like that. For hip internal rotation, I'm going to have her lift her knee off the mat. No, let me just sit up. Lift her knee up off the mat, her foot pointed towards the side. I'm going to place my top hand just proximal to her knee joint. My bottom hand is going to be proximal to her ankle joint. I'm going to ask her to hold the position as I try to push down with the top hand and pull inward towards my towards uh, her other leg with my bottom hand. So hold it, don't let it push down. Okay. And the gravity eliminated position for this will be the person is going to be laying on their back. Their legs straight, their legs will be straight, and then you will ask them to point for internal rotation, you will ask them to point their toes towards their other foot. And for external rotation, you ask them to point their toes towards you. And so that is external and internal ro rotation, gravity eliminated position. So for, for knee flexion, manual muscle testing, you will have the person on their stomach. For the against gravity position, you will have the person on their stomach, you'll have them slightly flex their knee. Their knee. I'm going to place my hand to stabilize her knee joint just proximal to the knee. I'll have my other hand just proximal to the ankle and I will ask her to hold that position. Do not let me push down. Okay. Okay. Now for knee extension, the person will be sitting on the side of the mat. And I will place, again, place my hand here, just proximal to the knee to stabilize her knee joint. I will ask her to kick her leg out. For knee extension, you do not have them fully extend their knee because